Hello, Formula One fans. Today, we've got a bold prediction from none other than Eddie Jordan, the seasoned motorsport pundit. In a recent interview, Jordan declared, no chance, of Red Bull coming unstuck in F1 2024. Join us as we dissect Jordan's insights, analyze the factors behind his confident statement, and explore what this could mean for the dynamic landscape of Formula One. Let's dive into the details. Former F1 team owner Eddie Jordan told David Coulthard there is, no chance, the likes of Mercedes and Ferrari jump to Red Bull's level, tipping them to walk F1 2024. Red Bull set a new standard for Formula One dominance in the season just gone, claiming 21 Grand Prix wins out of 22, with 19 of those scored by their now three-time world champion Max Verstappen. That left Mercedes, Ferrari, McLaren and Aston Martin to battle among themselves for best of the rest status, which seemed to move around with each passing race weekend. With the regulations remaining stable into F1 2024, the likes of Mercedes and Ferrari are preparing new look challenges in the bid to reel Red Bull in, but Jordan does not rate their chances of doing so highly at all, even if the grid should close up. They should finish first and second next year and walk away with the constructors, Jordan predicted of Red Bull on the Formula for Success podcast. Max, can he win 20 Grand Prix, can he improve on where he was this year? My view is no, because when you don't have big rule changes, and this coming year there's no big rule change, the car's concertina. At that point, 13-time Grand Prix winner Coulthard made the case for Mercedes and Ferrari making major gains for F1 2024, suggesting they, surely, spent the second half of last season mastering their F1 2024 preparations. Red Bull exceptional, and I agree, I think it's unlikely they can surpass that next year, he said. But I would throw the question out there to you EJ that, even though there's not a big regulation change next year, surely, Mercedes, Ferrari and the likes have spent most of the second half of the season going, look, we're not in this world championship battle, we've got to understand where our deficiencies are and put all our efforts into next year. So surely, they should be closer, or maybe even able to beat where Red Bull are. Jordan offered a clear, no chance, in response to that, revealing that his cycling pal and Red Bull design guru Adrian Newey has a real pep in his step a clear sign that he is very confident over Red Bull's situation. No, no chance, simple, said Jordan in response to Coulthard. When you're building a car and you have somebody of the likes of Adrian Newey and his team, which full marks to them, phenomenal to achieve this kind of landmark, because this probably may never be beat, we may look back in 20, 30 years time and you'll say, you know that 2023, that was just off the charts brilliant for what was achieved. Now, I'm sure some teams will come close in terms of time, but Red Bull are going to move further on, so my view is that the last half of the season, where everyone else was trying to do things against each other and the big battle that they had at Mercedes and indeed Ferrari, that was time for Red Bull at home, honing in their talents for next year's car. So they have had, in my opinion, five or six months lead time on that car for next year. I don't see anyone coming close to them. Verstappen will be looking to match Sebastian Vettel's Red Bull achievement in F1 2024 by winning four world championship titles in a row. The key pillars in the Red Bull machine seem to have been working in harmony for much of their tenures, senior advisor and driver program boss Helmut Marko, plus team principal Christian Horner having been there since the very start of Red Bull racing, while design legend Adrian Newey joined the following year in 2006. And with Red Bull having now re-established dominance over the F1 grid, Claiming back-to-back -back drivers and constructors title doubles, there seems to be very little reason for unrest in the team, though speculation has suggested otherwise. Red Bull has won an incredible 19 of the 20 Grand Prix held so far in F1 2023, making the RB19 arguably the greatest challenger in Formula 1 history. Designed under Newey's watch, Jordan believes motor racing has never seen a better partnership than Horner and Newey, a tandem which he warns Red Bull would be very wise not to disturb. In conclusion, Eddie Jordan's, no chance, prediction for Red Bull in F1 2024 adds a layer of anticipation to the upcoming season. Stay tuned as we follow the team's journey and see if Eddie's confidence stands the test of time. If you're as intrigued as we are, don't forget to subscribe for more exclusive updates from the world of Formula One. Thanks for joining us, and until next time, see you in the next video.